Um, it's been a very hectic, I will not lie, a very hectic, stressful three months. I will say coming to Bongol has done a lot. I came here to actually sharpen my skill of communicating and to know, to, have to, to gain the knowledge of, of doing it right. We have pushed and tussled and turned and it stretched us. It really challenged us, but here we are. Better public speakers, better, more conscious of what events are about and how to navigate an audience professionally. I was invited to the graduation of the batch of 2019A um, by one of the graduates, I came. Um, I knew her before she started attending Congo and I know what she was like then. And then coming to the graduation and watching her present um, to the crowd, I was really impressed at how confident she was, how much she had improved her diction, her command of the stage. And I thought if you know, if she could be transformed this much, then I want to be next in line. I actually got to know about Song Nkonga Silbertong from a friend. She was an alumni, but she introduced me to the institution and I got enrolled. I have all my life been a science student, but I ventured into arts to want to know how to express myself publicly. It was one of my son, Ashul, that encouraged me to come. Yeah, my dad was actually an alumni. He, he graduated 2019A. So whenever he comes home, he is kind of excited. We're back from classes, you will see him practicing his speeches. Yeah, at times, uh, saying aloud the national, oh, the Congo anthem, sorry. So, <laughs> With that, I had the interest of coming to his graduation. I was here and it was super awesome. So after that, he was kind of suggesting that I enroll and I said, why not? It's, it's going to be a great learning experience for me. Congo was introduced to me through a friend, Barista Farimata Ali Babakano, who is, she is also an alumni of this Institute. Yes, my husband introduced Congo Silverton through a friend who happened to be an alumni in the Institute. I believe I've been equipped with the knowledge of public speaking and I would be able Like when you see him, you will not expect it. The way he corrected our diction, you think you can speak English, you think you know the way to pronounce some words, but he really taught us um, differently. I know how to pronounce doctor, not doctor, as we usually say it, but not bad. 
but instead of both, I learn a lot and I'm really missing Congo. Because I have learned a lot. After what I have learned, God has given me additional 14 children. I've managed a high school of teenagers. I've managed a festival with an audience of 40,000 people, including vendors, dignitaries, and guests. But this, this was unique. My confidence has risen. I believe I've been equipped with the knowledge of public speaking. And I would be able to stand before any size of crowd and express myself effectively. Yeah, it's an experience I will never forget. And I'll miss all of them. I would like to thank our instructors. We thank them very much. And I'm going to miss my children. <laughs> and I'm going to miss my classmates very, very much because I like eating a lot. I will keep <laughs> telling my class governor, you know I'm a breastfeeding mother, so I like eating. He will say, item seven is here. I will miss them all. Our relationship does not terminate here. Let's take it to the next level because it has been awesome all along. Thanking them is not enough. So, but um, I will just pray for them. May God Almighty keep on pro, um, um, guiding them and expanding their knowledge. We have become a family now. And moving forward, I believe we would continue to do great things together even after leaving Congo. All I can say is thank you everyone. And thank you to my instructors too. Without them, I wouldn't have been where I am today, I'm sure of it. I will tell them congratulations. Meet to part, part to meet. And uh, to my facilitators, I don't know even what to say, but I will say thank you, thank you, thank you today. Because whatever I said, like, I did not say it. To my classmates, I'm really going to miss so many of them. They are really fun to be with. Rafiat, Mr. Bam. Mm. Wow, I will miss them a lot. It's something different from the war. It's something different from Shula Boys. It's, it's a positive story, and I think the world should know that there are definitely positives within the Northeast. And Adamawa is a shining example all the training requirements for the speech writing, public speaking, event and project management course at the Media and Language Training Institute. I wish to formally induct you all into the alumni of Congo Silver Town. From this historic day, you have been conferred with all the rights and privileges of the association as enshrined in the constitution of Congo Silver Town. I join the management, staff and fellow alumni in congratulating you all on this historic achievement. As proud graduates of this prestigious citadel of learning, you now have the mandate to play a pivotal role in promoting the mission and projecting the vision of Congo Silver Town, thereby expanding the Institute for Frontiers at all times. Congratulations.